today we are going to Suan Peng in Ratchaburi. Yeah, yeah, yeah. still be a hidden place and undiscovered by international tourists. Most of tourists are Thai people. Suan Peng have a list of natural and cultural. There are local food, place to visit, a lot of activities to do, and to get experiences. For this trip, we are going to visit Man Hom Tian, Nice Step Waterfall, the Scenery Vintage Farm, and Oak Bai Local Market. Here is the Ban Hom Tian, which is the most popular attraction in Lachaburi for 18 years. Ban Hom Tian is mean a house of candles. It's a place that creates the art of the candle skin. And inside, you will see the decoration is light in the first wall. Let's see. Ban Hom Tian Cafe, which is on the top of Ban Hom Tian. Here you will see the panoramic wheel just in front of you. Um, you can take a drink here. Here is a signature dish at Ban Hom Tian because the glass here is made from bamboo. And this drink, I ordered the Nam Kho Chiap. It's a hibiscus drink. The color is in a red and it's made with the soda. It's very refreshing here with that um, a little bit hot here. And this place is very popular for the family and also for the friends to have a relax and chat, chit chat. Okay, let's see around. In front of us, here is the Tanau Sea Hills. It's a border separate between Thailand and Burma. Just over there. going to participate the uh, activities which is the making of a candle let's see For the activity with the candle making, it's a akabaga in orange. So cute. Made by me. <laughs> so excited. <laughs> And here inside here is a gift shop. You can buy um, a candle for your souvenirs. Yeah, to give your friend and your um, your family. It's really cute. We have a lot of things here that you can buy it, and it's very it's very chic.
And now we finish at Bad Hom Tian. At the exit, you will get the souvenir for free when you change the ticket. And you receive get free for the um, souvenir, the candle. And next after that, we will go to the waterfall. Let's see. Go. Now we are at Nam Kok Gao Chan. Oh, it's main the night floor waterfall. Here they have many family to come to have a picnic. You can bring the food and also the drinks to have a picnic here. For the Nam Tok Gao Chan, um, they have nine floors, which have one, two, nine. And now we are at second floor. For the picnic, you can have a picnic from the first floor to the third floor. And on the sixth floor, is the most beautiful waterfall. And on the fourth floor, you can walk to the Bo Kung Hot Spring. In Sun Hung, they have a lot of accommodation such as a hotel, homestay, and also for the camping because in Suan Kheng, they have beautiful nature. And for tonight, we are going to the Pu Pa coffee camp. We're going to do the camping. See you there! And now we just finish our tent here. And here tonight we're gonna stay in the middle of the pine forest. Our tent is just in front of the lake with the lake view. It's very nice. You're gonna see it. Good morning, and now I'm at the cafe in the morning. It's just nearby our town. It's called Pa Coffee Cafe. And this cafe is in the middle of the pine forest, just, just near our camp. And here is our breakfast. I take the ice go go, yeah. And I take the amazing croissant here. It's the almond croissant with caramel. So nice. And then after we finish breakfast, we will go to the Old Pai Market. It's a local market. Let's see what And now we are live at Old Boy local market. It's a local market of the Carrion now. This market is open from 7 o'clock to 2 o'clock in the 
afternoon. And this market is nearby the river. And oh boy, it's made the relax. So people come here to relaxing. Inside, they have many shops of the local people. They have the food and also for the souvenir from the Korean people. And inside the market, you will see all the shops that they decorate by the um, Korean style. The highlight at Old Boy Market is for the um, offer the food to the mall in the in the morning around 7:30 to 8 o'clock in the morning. But today is for unfortunately I'm I'm late so I cannot offer the food to the mall. Okay, let's see inside. Go. This area here is for the food massage by bamboo, by natural therapies. And you can also be sitting on side of the river to relax. Put the feet in the water to make a relax. And here our lunch. And what we have, um, we have pad thai. It's like a pad thai with chums. Yes, very popular in this market. And here is the hanom jin yeok kuai. It's a wrap misal with the coconut milk and tang of banana. And this one is a pork gill. I will open it later. And this one is for dessert with coconut milk. It's a little bit hot. It's like the coconut milk cake. Let's try it. Danica. It's a pork and the sticky rice inside. It's hot. <laughs> Very nice. Let's try it. Come below. Mm. 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 No, 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 it's very smooth, very soft, and a little bit sweet. You can put some chili on it and peanut and mix it. It's going to be going to be good. Okay, I finished with dessert. Here is the ice cream, um, cocoa milk ice cream and coconut dessert. And then we will sit around to shopping something for my souvenir. And then we will go to the scenery farm. Let's see there.
arrived at Scenery Vintage Farm, our last stop for this trip. The Scenery Vintage Farm is the most popular destination for the family in Tuan Phuong District. And in this place, they have a lot of activity to do with your family for your children, such as the archery, feeding food to animals, the troll balloons, and also they have the ship shows. In the scenery farm designed like uh, English country. So they have many people come here to take a photo and post on their social. And here, that is also the restaurant name, Honey Scene Kitchen. It's the restaurant of the European food mixed with the Thai food. And in the restaurant, you can also see the sheep farm wheel, the back of the restaurant. And now we have finished our trip in Suan Hung Lashaburi Province. If you come to Thailand, I recommend you to visit in Suan Hung because they have a lot of activity to do and they have many places to visit. For the Suan Hung, you can visit all the years, but the best period to travel is in winter, during the November to February. Thank you so much for watching the video. If you like, please give a thumb up and subscribe and see you next video. Bye!